What's up, hoes? Small just a little bit. Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you have never been here, my name is Emma Tamsin Hill. You can click the subscribe button down here and click the bell so that you're notified when I upload. <laughs> Today, I'm back with a haul. I feel like I've had no motivation at all to film a haul or like a serious video, not like a serious video, but like one where it's like set up and you know, and I'm still talking to you instead of me just running around my house burning food so today we're going to be doing a misguided haul i have not done a misguided haul for a good year and a bit like so, and i think they've really stepped up their plus size range so we're going to try it out today and i'm going to let you know what i think i hope you're all doing well i hope you're all staying safe during quarantine i hope you're staying home I got these clothes gifted to me by Misguided, so thank you so much to Misguided for gifting me. No, it does not mean I'm gonna say amazing. Oh my God, the clothes are sensational. If it's shit, it's shit. You know what I say, if a cow's a cow, I've fucking forgotten what it is again. Like I said, I've not really had the motivation to film a haul, even though I definitely have a few hauls to film. So, this is more so for your entertainment rather than anything else. I know some of you guys might have got let go from work, and all that kind of stuff due to what's going on in the world right now. If, if that's the case, my heart goes out to you, sweetheart. I feel like everyone is in a very uncertain time. Hopefully this is just a bit of light entertainment for you all. And I'm not like shoving clothes down your throat. Like, you need to buy this. Because you don't, babe. Just have, have a look at me. Try some clothes on and let's have a giggle. All right. Before we get into all of that, today's video is very kindly sponsored by Shop Tagger. You guys know that I've worked with Shop Tagger a lot before in the past, and if you don't know about them, I'm gonna tell you right now. So Shop Tagger is an app that really helps you shop smart. So it's like an add-on for your browser, there's also an app on your phone. It enables you to, when you're online shopping, save items that you're looking at into different lists. And in those lists, when they're on your Shop Tagger account, Shop Tagger will notify you when it goes on sale, when the item is back in stock in your size, all of that fun stuff. So you never miss out if you're looking at a piece and you're like, oh, is that a Oh my God, when it comes back in stock, can I talk? I can't talk. When it comes back in stock, Shop Tagger will let you know. They also have an amazing piece of the add-on that when you are in checkout on a website, you're paying for your stuff, boom, bish, bash, bosh. You've done a big ass fucking shopping spree here, love. And they will help you look for coupons to get money off that order. Can we get an amen up in here? So often I've been shopping on a website and I get to the checkout and then this little, little boop, it'll pop into the page and be like, check for coupons. It checks. I have saved a stupid amount of money. I can't even lie to you. I've been been able to save like 60 pound on some orders. It's just so good just having something that looks for coupons for you instead of having to troll the websites. You get on a website, it's like, oh, use this code and it fucking expired 10 years ago. I can't be doing with it. So having something that works automatically, thank you. That's great. Shop Tagger are also holding a $1,000 competition this month. So all you need to do to be entered to win this money is download the app onto your phone. Also download the extension to your web browser. Save one item from this haul. All the links will be down below as always for all the items featured in this haul. And that's it, you're entered. And the competition ends on the 29th of April. I'm sure we could all use $1,000. So, make sure you're into that so thank you again shop tiger for sponsoring this video you know i love you so let's get into the clothes also before we start this dress is actually from daisy street curve on asos i really like it it's cute very oversized i like the little mm -hmm. belt is nasty gal but let's get into this also i'm in a bit of a different setup today i felt like switching it up i hope you don't mind i hope you don't think it's ugly but yeah this is a different part of my kitchen. This is the first piece. This is a little like two piece tracksuit. I'm a cool mom kind of vibe. So it comes as a set. I got it in a 24 and it's this lovely like denim bluey color, um, like a quarter zip up here. So you can have it down. You can have it up whatever you want babe or i just really like it so this is like obviously quite oversized has the big pocket in the middle which i like 
cozy comfy and the bottoms are really high waisted really nice nice and soft and stretchy yeah like i really like it i think it's like definitely very well sized like a lot of tracksuits and this kind of stuff sometimes the joggers can be like tight but these fit really well and i think it looks really good it's not see-through so you don't have to worry about that i just feel like i'm living out my soccer mom fantasy especially with the fucking ponytail like oh my god i just go gotta go pick up bryson from Fago practice <laughs> with this haul i went for comfy stuff like a few loungewear bits and then i also got some sexy dresses so I'll be excited to try them as well. Next is this little tracksuit set. And this is from the Playboy collection. I've always wanted to try something from the misguided Playboy collection, but they don't always do like all of it in plus size. They only do like a few bits in plus size, which sucks, but I got this. Now, this is so soft. Like the inside lining of this is so fleecy, so soft. I love it. So let me start with the top. So this is obviously just a little cropped hoodie. I think I got it in a 24, but it just has embroidery of Playboy right here. Nice big hood. I love the color of this. It's like a, a camel, but most camels don't look good on my skin tone, but because it's a bit of a darker brownie, I think it looks cute. Now the back of this is like ribbed. I'm not sure. It's kind of like corset-y style. I really like that. Yeah, this is kind of short though. So like if you're just like flinging your arms about and stuff, like kind of short especially if you've got big boobies but i really like the style of it and especially with the joggers because they sit so high-waisted so the joggers again they fit really good i got these in a 26 actually because obviously i didn't know about the sizing and i wanted to make sure they were nice and big and comfy but these are super comfy the pockets are really deep high-waisted again with a nice tie that you can tie up yourself and again with the embroidery here of the playboy the ankles are like the little single cuff which is again nice and i just like this the last time i tried misguided the fit was not incredible but now these two pieces i'm really like surprised and happy with can i i can't i really can't speak today <laughs> i'm really happy with how these are fitting so far so this is the next piece it's a little minty green toothpastey looking two piece <laughs> so i love the color but Let's get into the fit. This is a 24. The shirt is really boxy. It's not super thick. It's kind of thin, if anything. Um, but I love how like boxy it is and oversized. And then I would like it, to be honest, if it was a little bit longer. But maybe that's just because I'm tall. But the shorts. So these are the cycling shorts. And they're really quite big for a 24, I feel like. Because like they're bunching. Can you see? I'm happy that they fit. Do you know what I mean? Because some people do it and it's like so tiny and you can't get your butt in there but these are very generous in size so for lounging around the house like this is super cute but i don't know if i could wear this like out out just because the fit isn't quite there like it isn't tight on my um thighs it's kind of bunching around the vagine so no one wants a bunchy vagine <laughs> okay also kind of see through but obviously the t-shirt covers that but yeah, very cute for around the house though, for pottering around, doing jobs. But I don't think I could go out, out in this. We're gonna get onto the last little loungewear piece. Look how cute this is. I'm so excited to try this. This is like actual pajamas, but I thought, hold on, let me just be real cute for a second and get some little silky pajamas. Okay, so this is so fucking cute. I can't go over how cute this is. I thought it was a play suit, but it is a little dress. And this is spicy mama obviously it's just like silky if you can see it has a lovely little heart print pattern all over so it's black with baby pink hearts i love this lace detail around here i think it's beautiful i just feel like a woman especially this fucking ponytail i'm giving you girly you know what i mean i don't know i'm holding my boobs why do all girls do this when they're just like so it has an elastic waistband here and the sides are completely cut out. So I do have a bra on right now, but if you was gonna wear this for your means, uh, you might wanna have your teeth out, you know, easy access. The back is like this. I love the deep V at the back because it shows off my tattoo. And I feel like a low plunging back is so sexy, but like so subtle at the same time. It's a lovely touch. Yeah, the sides are all open. You can have all your little 
roles hanging out because that's Q2 girls, just remember that. A moment, definitely. A moment for yourself, a moment to wear around your partner. Like it's just a moment in every sense of the word. I love this. So cute. I already know I'm about to look like a fucking potato sack. This looks really good on the, to be honest, I'm kind of liking it a lot. I'm kind of liking it a lot more than I thought I would. This looked really good on the model on site. So far, I'll give it a go. It's creased to fuck. Apologies, I haven't ironed it or seamed it or whatever. But the shape is nice. Like, it's really hard to do this kind of like balloon dress on a bigger figure because we can sometimes end up just getting lost and looking like a big potato. But I feel like this is lovely. Okay, so let me talk through it. It's just like a shirt dress. Um, there is buttons from here all the way up to here. So you can like do some of them. Oh, well, I'm really feeling this. I feel like on the camera, it's gonna be washed out as anything. But in person, it's like a lime green. I feel like it looks a, like more like a yellow on there. It's the lime green, nice little collar, lovely little puff sleeves with little um, buttons here as well. And then it goes into like tiered ruffles, but it is longer at the back than it is at the front. So it's a little high-low situation. Let me put the camera down. But because it's high-low, I think it looks super gorgeous. It's a very lovely cut that is super nice for my body shape. So if it was the whole same length all the way around, I feel like I would look like a potato. But because it's tiered, I feel like it looks really good. You could also put a belt with this. That would be super nice as well. But I honestly think you could get away with wearing this just on its own. You know I'm into kind of an oversized vibe anyway, so I really think this is cute. But still, doesn't make my body look like Mr. Blobby. So there we go. Next, we have a bodysuit. Not the jeans, these are from yours, but the bodysuit. So it's just a ribbed black bodysuit with buttons all the way up here. Are these real buttons? Oh, they're real buttons. We love a real button. Yeah, it's just super cozy, soft, like mm, nice little cozy material. I like it, I like it a lot. And it's not cutting me in half. Body suits for me are a struggle because obviously I am quite tall. We've been through this. And a lot of the time, like they just don't fit or they're just cutting me in half. But this is super soft and stretchy and like a jersey material. So it's really nice and stretches and it's comfortable. Cause a lot of bodysuits sometimes aren't comfortable, but this one definitely is. So this is our next piece. It's a little zebra cheetah print, living out my Carol Baskin fantasy. Um, I'm pretty sure it's zebra. Zebra print top. So it has these cute little sleeves with the little um what's it fucking called elastic around the wrist and it's i really like the way that it's made so it has like these cups here like this and then it comes down into a little peplum if anything i would say this runs small like this is the only thing that we found so far that i feel like runs a bit small but this is such a cute top for like literally jeans and a nice top that is this this is such a going out for drinks with the fucking girls after quarantine's over kind of top. <laughs> Don't you think? I like it. It's cute. It's not really my style per se. What the hell? But I do think it's super cute and I do like the way this is cut. If you had bigger boobs, there is definitely room in here if you are a more busty woman. Oh, I've just realised it has a little secret zip here. I just whack the thing over my head and hope for the best. Yeah, there definitely is a bit of room here, but if you have a really big chest, I don't know if this would be great for you because it kind of is like sewn in cups. Because I'm no titty Tina, it's working out all right. <laughs> We're on the home straight. This is a cute little dress. So this is like a ribbed, I can't even explain it. It's like a stone mocha color. Um, yeah, like I said, it's ribbed. So it's super stretchy, super soft. I feel like I should have got this in a size down because it is a little bit big, I feel like. So yeah, I don't know how I feel about it. I think I like it, but there's certain things that are like putting me off. It's like sleeveless and then it has these attached sleeves that you like put on after you put the dress on. So they're always annoying because they never stay up. <laughs> so there's that. But I think the thing that's throwing me off the most is this. Can you see this? It's like little fucking Star Trek 
Phew. Like, why are they flying off? Where are you going? I don't like these little bits that like stick up. I wish it was just literally like a vest. Like, why did them bits have to be like that? I don't understand. Also, like, because the way this is cut, the armpit vagina is out. The armpit chub will be out. And you can't really cover it because it doesn't look right. Like, I love the style of these kind of vests and dresses, but like armpit chub is out, which is fine, but I don't feel like it goes with the aesthetic. <sighs> these are falling down already. Yeah, I just feel like this is definitely cute, but I don't particularly think it goes well with my skin color either. I feel like you need a richer complexion for this kind of dress. Cute, but too big, and I just don't know about it, darling. Maybe with, maybe with a bit of fake tan on, I might warm to it. So this is our last dress and I can't lie, I like it a lot. So I tried this dress on before because I wore it in my Don't Rush Challenge that I did with the girls. If you haven't seen it, then go and watch that. I'll put it down below. But I just think this is super cute. Like this is a sexy dress. This is the dress that you're going to wear first night back in the club after lockdown, yeah? This is what you're gonna wear. I just think it's so beautiful. And I feel like I definitely do need a bit of fake tan on with it. Because again, colours similar to my skin tone, uh, I just feel like it doesn't really work. I feel like this one's better because it's more warmer toned, whereas this was more like cooler toned. But this is like a slinky material, but it's like a really good slinky material because it's double lined. So it's not thin as anything. Like it's really nice and like thick, double lined. And then it's ruched all the way down the sides, which makes your booty pat, okay? Like your bum is going to look outrageous in this dress. Okay. All those squats you'd be doing on your home workout, yeah, they're going to pay off in this dress. So again, the armpit vagina's out, but for some reason I don't mind it in this dress. I kind of like it, in fact. I don't know what it is, I just, this is just super cute to me, I really like it. I just think what they've done with this is perfect for curvier women, because this ruching on the side just cinches our bodies and makes us look hella cute. So, that was the last item I had to show you all today. I really hope you enjoyed this haul. I will try and film some more so that they will keep you company during this time. I'm gonna film again tomorrow morning, so hopefully if I can just smash out loads of content, that will be great because I start getting anxiety when I haven't uploaded hauls and you guys are like, where's the hauls? And I'm like, <sighs> all because I'm just in my house being an idiot. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to sign up to get Shop Tugger down below. It's completely free. I'll put the link down there. And also to enter that competition because you could win a thousand dollars, baby. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.